All right, so this row of buildings on this block was said to be Indian schools or something. Seems kind of odd and, oh, that doesn't even show up. Hmm. Oh well. That's better. A little more daylight, you can just kind of see. I saw one guy make a, a tour on the inside. I didn't really get a chance to see if he uh, put any video of the outside. Because I didn't watch the whole thing, but I had to take a look. He said it's all boarded up, and I see there's a board on the door over here. That door is kind of new looking. <clears throat> they were allowed to enter for a while to look inside. I'm guessing this is probably the building he entered. But it could have been one of these. They're just... You look at the bricks and there's four buildings of the same type of brick ordered from the same place probably. <clears throat> I can't really look in here. I can raise the camera up. What could be seen? I have to look at that later. That's a stretch. It's like eight feet high. <clears throat> but he said it's an Indian school, and I don't see how where any signs that point to it. <clears throat> he might have entered through this garage door. That looks that looks like it can open. Yep. He might have entered through that garage door. And then, yeah, I think he entered through the garage door. <laughs> it's all boarded up. I to get a good look on the outside at least. Or maybe you could enter through that door too. It looks like the door is not even closed all the way. At least parts of it aren't. Oh, yep. Okay, you can enter. Yep, this is exactly what he recorded. There's the toilet. <laughs> and it rains, so now it's nice and wet. This is an Indian school? I, I watched the guy's video on quiet because it was on mobile. So I don't know what it was said. And I'm stepping in a lot of poop and I have holes in my shoes. This is interesting. Now this might be for an office. They definitely, they definitely cleared it out. Wow. This has been a cleared out building. Okay. Very roomy though. No, no trespassing signs, which is a surprise. Lots of broken windows. There's a, there's a recreational vehicle over there. It is really hard to tell if this is actually a, an Indian museum or not because, or Indian school or not, because where would the classrooms be? It's like one gigantic classroom. This is more of a warehouse. They didn't design this to be a, for classrooms initially, or at least had a very unique, um, like perspective on it, how to put together a, a school. Schools aren't normally built like this. This is very unique. Yeah, I double doors would. Why would you do that? It's just one huge building with little minor buildings off to the side. I do not believe this is an Indian school. Okay, those are the those are offices for the workers. You can go up for whatever. But this is a huge, this is like a factory or something. A warehouse, or an old factory or old warehouse with the wooden posts and whatnot. And unique pipes everywhere. Okay, well that's all I need to see. <laughs> you can still get inside. Now I gotta figure out how I got in. Which isn't too hard because it's just one big empty building yeah see this <clears throat> jesus jesus torres 
Vatan Court. Vatan Court. So that's a really important message there. Ger Greer Bow. Okay. Yeah, why would a school have this this type of garage door? Alright, that's for a warehouse. Double doors over there. Yeah, this is some kind of a warehouse. <coughs> and um, I guess they're not too concerned. Hey, there's a bathroom. I didn't even see that. And oh my god, that's a skeleton. That's quite the skeleton that got caught in there. <laughs> wow. Pigeon. See, things really didn't... Uh, well, there's so many broken windows. But you know why that is? I don't think it's anything to do with people. I think it's from um, hailstorms that have been occurring. I saw a video of a hailstorm that occurred on on Mon May in May of this year. Some guy made a YouTube of it, and that that uh, this uh, slippery elm tree grows fast. Uh, you know, I'd have to study how f uh, how fast they can grow, but you could see it's gotten pretty tall. So it's it's been this area has been uh, unchecked for quite a while. So yeah, why would they design a, a school? Maybe I should ask him if he's sure if it was a school or not, because it doesn't look like the layout of a school. See the X building off in the distance for the unit, the Utah State University, and the building that I was inside. It's got a unique shape to it. <clears throat> and then a lot of new homes. 